Hey guys, and welcome back to The Flake Files. Today, I'm gonna to be showing you our recipe for chicken salad sandwiches. And I'm actually gonna be making this in the Instant Pot, which I have never done before. And I'm also gonna be doing the chicken, shredding up the chicken with a hand mixer. Here, I'm just adding a cup of water to the bottom. And then I'm adding a teaspoon of chicken bouillon to make just a cup of chicken broth. And I'm adding a sprinkle of onion powder, garlic powder, black pepper, and poultry seasoning. I usually also add lemon pepper, but I didn't have any, so I just added maybe half a teaspoon of lemon juice to this. And then I'm gonna be adding in some frozen chicken breast tenderloins, and I think I did about six of them. Then we're gonna put the lid on, set it to sealing, and I put it on manual for nine minutes. And this was after it was done. I did do a quick release on it. Then I removed the chicken from the broth and I put it in this glass mixing bowl and I shredded it with my hand mixer, which turned out awesome. Once it was shredded to the consistency that we like, I added some mayonnaise and I think in total I did about a cup of mayonnaise which sounds like a lot but it was six chicken breast tenderloins and this made multiple sandwiches and I think I did about two teaspoons of yellow mustard I started on the seasonings and I did a shake of celery seed and dill weed, maybe an eighth of a teaspoon. So I would definitely do those to taste. Then I added a shake of onion powder. Then I did, a, did some freshly cracked black pepper. And then I did uh, salt to taste. I did go back in and use the hand mixer again just to make sure all the mayonnaise and everything was mixed in really well. Then I covered it with some pretzel seal and put it in the fridge and let it cool. To assemble these sandwiches, I sliced up some tomatoes. I also washed and cut up a head of iceberg lettuce and I toasted you know, two pieces of bread and I did lettuce and tomato on them. Um, on my husband's sandwich, I actually ended up putting mayonnaise on both pieces of bread and like mustard on it as well. And that is it. I cut the sandwiches in half and I served them with some chips and that was dinner. So thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and I'll see y'all later. Bye.